Hi there! I haven't done a video to email you like this for a long time so I thought let's spice it up a little bit and do one like this for you today as I tell you a little bit of a story about one of the clients I was training with the other day and we were talking about how amazing she's done with her transformation so her stomach has gone right down compared to what she was like she's lost weight all over more toned than she's ever been and she was saying about how so many of her friends and people that she knows on her social media had started to inbox her asking her how would she done it how would she changed so much so she was saying how she used to spend so much time then replying back to them saying about the transformation programs how she started with the detox week went on to the 21 is now in the inner circle and has kept on going and because she kept doing all of that eating good food she still loves to go out and eat out with her husband and her friends and have a little drink and everything like that but she's getting incredible results. But how she was getting so frustrated that all of these people that she was like tagging in things and replying to were doing absolutely nothing nothing at all after she had said this is what I have done and this is what I recommend for you. So why is that? What we call people like that, it's not a very nice term but it's a bit of an ask call because you ask questions all the time and you don't do anything about this. I'm not saying that you're one of these people now or anything like that. However, are you one of those action takers that is taking small steps towards massive results? Or are you one of those people that watches videos, reads statuses, looks at photographs of transformations and thinks, I wish I was like that? I know a lot of people do. I mean, the other day, someone came around to my house and said to me, oh my gosh, Sa, I saw your progress pic the other day. I wish I was like that. And it's like... Do something then. You can be like that. There's no point in wishing because they don't come true unless you take action on them and then they can come true. So all you've got to do, top tip guys, get a plan. Detox Week is starting now. You are more than welcome to join that because I will share with you and the rest of the group everything that I have done in my progress towards getting my body back after having Danny. So consistency, getting support and doing what you know you should do. Are you drinking way too many cups of tea? Like one of my clients I spoke with the other day. Are you going for so long during the day without eating and then you're having a chocolate bar and then by the time you get home in the night, you're just having a continuous meal of stuff and stuff and stuff because you're telling yourself, I haven't eaten all day so I can have all of this. Are you on a diet, so you're having tiny amounts of breakfast, tiny amounts at lunch, and then you're so hungry by the end of the day that your willpower is just completely gone, you're not motivated, you're like, screw it, I'm just gonna have everything, and then as soon as the last mouthful is going down your neck, you're like, oh, why did I do that? And then you're starting again. So we all know these habits and these patterns and these vicious cycles that people are continuing to do the same thing all of the time. But how about doing something different or something you've done before and you know what has worked for you, but you weren't consistent and stay doing it and actually getting results. So my message to you right now, okay? Don't be one of those people that keeps on asking and wishing for it. Take action and get it. Like Michelle, for example, that has now lost 12 and a half pounds in just under a month and it's all because she did the detox week to start off with so you can be just like Michelle and get those results be the next transformation success story and I would love to see you in the team if you want to join the detox group then the link is attached to this video and I will see you in there getting ready and all excited and prepped on the weekend have a good one see ya bye